Hi everyone, Liz here. Thanks for stopping by. So it's the 7th of December. Woo! Okay, that's a week into the Christmas month. Woo! Okay, so uh, I've just got my unboxing to do today. I did make a start on my uh, Christmas tree skirt yesterday because we have got the Christmas tree up and no skirt. So I'll put a picture in as to how far I've got, which unfortunately isn't very far at the moment. Um, I've been furniture moving this morning um, and I managed to try and get a tall boy down the stairs and managed to drop it and I've broken quite a few bits of it but I think I can put it back together <laughs> but I've also broken all my nails as well because as I had hold of it it just took my nails when it dropped but hey ho that's what happens uh, when you just sort of like on your own and uh, yeah try to do things that maybe I should have asked one of the neighbours or somebody for help but I don't like asking other people for help i like to try to do things myself anyway enough of that um i did oh i will just quickly show you my parcel yesterday was uh, this it is a pure light which is a lovely heavy base stand and a nice tall light with a big magnifier uh, it's got a little like stand thing that you can put bits in. I'm not sure that I'll use that. It's got a clip, so I suppose if you're doing cross stitch patterns or reading a book or whatever, it could hold those for you. Uh, maybe not reading a book. I don't know if it's strong enough for that. Um, but yes, yeah, so once I've got that set up, I will let you see that. But it's a four in one magnifying lamp. You can actually take that base there and put it on that base there and have it desk standing as well, which is good. But what I was finding was my old lamp, oops, which is this one, which I love. Um, and I did say it was one of my favourite items um, on my questions from Mrs. Coffee. Um, I'm finding that this is getting in the way because I have to have it clipped on somewhere. And I find that that's really restrictive, particularly doing my Santa Express. Uh, with it already being um, on the board, I'm finding that I can't get to see bits because it's not stretching far enough. And I do intend to have a go at doing bigger canvases. Oof. Anyway, so this one will now live upstairs. So hopefully I can do some whip and chats now upstairs because I've got my magnifying light up here as well. And this one is for downstairs. And actually this tucks away really nicely as well. Um, so it's going to be a lot better. So that was my only Black Friday purchase. Um, yeah, it had £15 off, I think, at Hobby, at Hobby Craft. Speak properly, Liz. Um, yeah, so I thought, oh, well, I've been looking at them for a while. And I thought, well, with £15 off, it was actually cheaper than Amazon. So go Hobby Craft. So there you are. As I say, I will show you it. But that's my interruption from yesterday's video when I got my new light. So let's have a look and see what we got in day number seven. I do like opening the bow. That's why I tie it back up every day because it's nice just to reopen it again. Okay. Um, right, number seven is this little box over here with the very stern looking reindeer on it. So let's have a look. Oh, 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 that's heavy. That is a heavy box. Do a shape test. Feels like something a bit soft. Oh, look, somebody's been getting into this before me. Oh, and I don't peek. So, right, let's see what we've got. Da, 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 da. Oh, oh, okay. So, lots of special. Oh, <laughs> look at that. <laughs> It's a big duck. <laughs> Does that duck look happy to you? I don't think he's been very happy being stuck in my box all that time, do you? <laughs> so we've got a cross reindeer that's ha ha ha. I've had you stuck in that box all that time. <laughs> oh dear. So it's one of these, it's cork backed uh, like a tile coaster. So yeah, brilliant. Um, they've even put the little tab on look so you can pull it back and it's a full drill. So you're gonna be drilling the whole of the duck. We've got all different, we've got an L, a K and an H. So there's three different sizes of 
gems that are going to go on this so a bit like those little pictures that are like um special full drills as i call them uh, and then we've got the beak and the black for the eyes and around the beak but i just think that is so funny oh brilliant but i like that that's a good size as well that's going to get a good size cup on it let's have a quick measure and have a look I wonder if everybody's getting the same ones. I'll have to have a watch with the other people that are doing the unboxings. So it's a 10 centimetre round, which is a four inch round. So I think that'll take most mugs. That's really good. That's a really good size. I did get one uh, earlier in the year that was the, like the little monkey, the little square monkey. Actually, I meant to be doing that for Christmas. <gasps> Another project to do. Oh no. So that's that one. And then, oh, it comes in these funny drill packets look must be different factories different uh, ways to do them it comes in these like um little pouches rather than these strips uh, so yes yeah, so that's gonna be his beak which is number 17 wow okay so that's like a peachy orangey color sorry i've got the light on and the flashes on on the camera because it is so dark today had a lot of rain this morning as well uh, which probably wasn't a good job to be taking out furniture into the garage um, in the rain. So I've got all wet as well as uh, ruining all my nails. But hey ho, just another day in the Harrison household. <laughs> Millie just sat at the door and looked at me as if to say, well, if you think I'm following you around, you've got another thing coming. All right, so that's some little black drills there. And then we've got the three sizes that are going to go on the duck. So we've got the standard size drills and your slightly bigger ones and then your bigger ones all in this lovely like acidy lemony colour so yeah they're going to be quite good to do quite a quick little project that one I might get that one done uh, and then again I might not <laughs> I have so much to do at the moment it's ridiculous sure that is day number seven I must admit I am uh, impressed with these Um, that's another one you know they're all ones that I don't think um, I would say, well, that's not value for money, an advent calendar that's cost this much. So we'll pop that back in there again. Woo so, oh, oh, number eight is uh, a long, thin one. Look, oh, I won't take it out, but that's a slightly different shape. It's not one of the square ones. Look, it's a, like a long, thin one. So we'll see what that one looks like. OK, so that's day number seven right i shall now pass you on to it's now christmas t-shirts i did say watch out for the t-shirts and then everybody else's advent calendars so this way okay so today's t-shirt is brought to you courtesy of teespring and this is my scotty with scarf on in a snowstorm and as i say it is a t-shirt uh, so we're on to t-shirts now rather than uh, jumpers uh, what i find is when we go to the uh, scotty retreats it's a nice v-neck t-shirt as well i always like the v-necks um, i tend to find that when you get t-shirts the crew necks are just a bit too much for me they're too tight around the neck so i like to get a v-neck but this one is absolutely enormous it's more like a dress but anyway i prefer them bigger and looser but yeah what i was finding was when i go to uh, the parties our um scottish terrier emergency care services um christmas parties and summer fates that we do um where all the scotties get together and there's probably about 100 plus scotty dogs all running around uh yeah i get really really warm particularly with jumpers on so i like to have t-shirts as well and these are my christmasy t-shirts so i just thought you'd like to see them okay that's today's t-shirt 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 <laughs> I'll see you tomorrow to see what next one is. Bye. Yeah, day number seven. Let's see what we've got. How many presents under the Christmas tree? Oh, yeah. Any there? Oh, is it four? Yeah. <laughs> I like this quiz, it's easy. Well, you have to do it with this thing on the back and write it in. I think it's. Oh, uh, right. Oh, there's them. the sleigh, look. 
and there's Mr. Whatever his uh, name yeah. was that we didn't know where he was yesterday. You have to go by the number you open. Oh, uh, right. And look underneath. It's baffled us, and I should think an average four year old will understand That's what it. I was looking at. <laughs> Millie, are you coming to do yours? Are you coming? Come on then. Come on, let's do your advent. Whoop. Oh, we're a bit excited this morning. Are you starving? Have we had you locked in a cupboard? Hey. So, what we're we looking for today? Number seven. Is that number seven? Yeah, right in the middle. There it is, look. What are you looking at? Let's look at number seven. Right in the middle. What's number seven? Oh, number seven's little bits again. Okay. And the little, oh, the little love hearts, look. The little love hearts. Oh, thank you very much. I love you too. We'll have to excuse the mess in here. We're just sorting out furniture. So having a bit of a move round for the Christmas tree and things. And another one. Are you looking? Are you thinking, what is all that mess over there? Eh? And yes, we do still have a cassette player. Because we still have cassettes. It's underneath you, look. It's there. <laughs> okay. Oh. And last one. Oh, you've got wet chops. Have you had a drink before you came in here? I think you have. Have you had a drink before you came in here? Eh? Oh. Oh, just give it bit of a scratch there just a sweet spot hey have they all gone now is that day seven all done okay say bye bye millie see you tomorrow bye bye just checking yep that's it then all done see you tomorrow Okay, well, I hope you've enjoyed seeing today's bit of fun um, and you can join me tomorrow if you've enjoyed seeing these. If you can give me a thumbs up, it would be much appreciated. And if you want to come back and see what we get in day number eight and see what uh, happens tomorrow, then if you press that subscribe button and the little bell next to it, you'll be notified when all my other videos come up. So thanks for stopping by. Hope to see you all again soon. Bye for now.